Hello and thank you for joining us for this, the premiere episode of SC Chromatography's Tips and Tricks Online. In this first episode, we're going to show you how to change the needle assembly in your Agilent 1100 series auto sampler. Let's get started. We're going to assume that most users are working with Agilent's ChemStation software to control their systems. Before proceeding, if you haven't already done so, make sure that the front cover is installed on the auto sampler. Now that you have the front cover installed, the next thing you're going to do is go to the Diagnostics Display View in ChemStation. You're then going to click on the Maintenance pull-down menu and select ALS Maintenance Position. The Injector Maintenance Positions pop-up window will appear. From this menu, click on the Start button under the Change Needle header. The needle arm will move into the maintenance position. Once the needle arm has stopped its activation sequence, remove the front cover from the auto sampler. With the front cover removed, click on the Needle Down button repeatedly. Continue clicking on the button until the needle set screw is aligned with the hole in the safety cover. Once the set screw is accessible, loosen, but do not remove the set screw from the needle arm. With the set screw loosened, remove the needle by lifting it up and out of the needle arm. Using two quarter inch wrenches, remove the sample loop fitting from the old needle and reconnect the new needle to the sample loop fitting. Tighten firmly. Carefully insert the new needle into the arm, making sure that it sits in the notch at the rear of the arm. Once you have the needle properly aligned in the notch, tighten the set screw firmly and we're almost done. Going back to ChemStation, you're going to click on the needle up button repeatedly. Do so until the needle is approximately two millimeters above the needle seat. You'll need to make sure that the needle is properly aligned with the center of the needle seat. If required, bend the needle slightly until proper alignment is achieved. Once you have the needle aligned, go back to ChemStation and repeatedly press the needle down button until the needle reaches its lowest position. Finally, you're going to replace the front cover on the auto sampler. Go back into ChemStation, click on the end button, and that's it. You have successfully changed the needle in your Agilent 1100 series auto sampler. Well, that wraps it up for this, the premiere episode of SC Chromatography's Tips and Tricks Online. We hope you learned a little something, and make sure you stay tuned for future episodes. Thanks for watching.